So I'm just uh, changing Emily. And I thought I'd just give you a details of her shoulders. They are just brilliant. I just love them. How they like completely go up and over. They are great. And little ears. So she's had a baby grow on overnight. And I'm just going to change her into this, which is um, one of the outfits I bought for her when I was at the doll show. Sorry, Emily. I'll just show you around these people. I'll show you around these. It is from Rocker by. Oh, I'll come back a bit. Rocker by Baby Boutique. Three to six months, and um, oh, it's just so pretty. Look at it. It's a lovely thick cotton material in pink. And it is a short T romper. So it's got drawstring here in the leg. So that'd be nice. It's got the poppers. It's got a little bow detail, little Peter Pan collar, and little sleeves. So what I'm going to do first of all is put it on without a t-shirt. She's got her vest on, which is the sleeveless vest that she came with. So I might just keep it on there like that and just put this on without a vest underneath. We will see. So here's the romper on my little girl. And look, I told you this kit, she has got big legs. It is strained. <laughs> Can you see the gather? Can you see the gather? Um, they're like the straining. like you can't really and it's not um it's kind of the material kind of feels like it's got a bit of a stretch in it but it is so not this girl's thing <laughs> back to the drawing board i don't know what it is about dumbo's i've took her hat off i don't know what it is about dumbo's nose but he's obviously a very good to grip because she absolutely loves Dumbo, don't you? Hey, you like his nose? She even tries to suck on his nose. Good job he's washable. Anyway, I'm going to show you some um, pictures of a few other outfits that I've dressed her in over the last um, week um, and took photos of. I think it's only a couple and then I'll show you the few things, extra things that I've picked up for her. So, like I say, she's quite happy there playing. I um, I picked up the outfit that she's wearing. <laughs> okay, so I've, she's got a bit of breathing playroom now because before she couldn't even hardly move her legs. So at least she can move her legs now. Hey, you can move your legs now. Yes, you can. Be careful there. Um, yes, yeah, so I bought this one. It's beautiful. And I also bought this one. And this is rocker by baby boutique three to six months and it is so soft i really wouldn't mind this against my skin i'm very fussy about the things that i have against my skin as well this is gorgeous another baby pink and it has this lovely heart um embroidered well it's flowers in the shape of a heart embroidered on the chest area and it's got a fake bow a bit of um, lacy ruching around the chest and then it gathers down into the feet so it gathers all the way down and then it's got poppers around so we call them over in the UK we call them baby grows um, because they're far too nice I guess in other countries they call them sleepers but yo no way this is way too nice as a sleeper <laughs> wouldn't want to put her to bed in it this would be for day wear because it's just super soft and super cute and I like to see babies in um baby grows as well oh it is just so soft and it's got a little bit of lace edging to the feet as well and the feet are just molded this it's such good quality 
they were both ten pounds. I think they were nine ninety five each. So that was a good deal. I really, really was impressed with that. And then the next two, which I showed you pictures of, but they I don't sure how clear they I can't remember how clear they came out. I bought actually bought for Heidi, but they were a bit long. And so they fit on little Missy here really well. This is Mayoral, which is a Spanish make of baby clothes. And I'm sure it says not just, oh, it says six months, maybe? 68 centimetres. It's got this lovely design. It's like a shift dress with the cap sleeves and um, piping around the neck blue piping and then it's got a whole seaside scene on it in um, blues variation of blues and greys muted um browns some yellows oh look at it look at the detail on that it's a little teddy bear girl um on a bike with some flowers in the basket some little beach huts um, a beach chair with an umbrella and a bucket and spade some lovely cushions that is gorgeous some shells and a butterfly and then the black the back is just blue and white striped so that's one and then another one I got for Heidi which again was too long for her is this lovely cotton white cotton dress that looks like a sailor um, sailor style dress so it's got no sleeves on it it's got a bib around the neck with um, navy blue piping and little embroidered anchors, navy anchors on the edges. And it's got an inverted pleat down through the middle, so it's like A-line. And it has got, uh, that goes out to a flare skirt, and it has got um, navy ribbon trim. So it kind of looks like, you know, something sailory sailor type dress <laughs> they both fit her well this one is maybe a little bit tighter around her to do up and um, it's because it's buttoned down the back or it's buttoned all the way down the back oh yeah it's got knickers as well and they do not fit her <laughs> i might be able to just squeeze them on for a bit of effect but she's three quarter leg so it doesn't really make that much difference um to her and it's lined, it's a cotton lined dress. Um, I think I got that thrifting, I think. Or I might have bought these both last year at Peter. I know I bought the mayoral one last year at Peterborough and then I had the car accident. So you didn't see any of a haul. Um, but I don't think, I think I got this one in our um, little thrifty shop here in one of our villages. And then the next set is a five piece set. And on the way home from Sheena's, I had to call in and do some grocery shopping because I'd been away from home for a week and there would be no food in the house. So despite driving a five hour drive, <laughs> I had to go in and get some groceries. And while I was there, of course I looked at the baby stuff from this little new little Missy. They didn't really have a lot. But I did pick up this set in um, one of our supermarkets that's called Morrison's. So it's a five part set. It's a baby grow. Look how gorgeous that is. It's a white background and it's got gorgeous pinks and blues, greens, reds, greys, and flowers and ladybirds and butterflies and bunny rabbits. And I don't quite know what that's supposed to be there, but I'm assuming that it's like a dragonfly. But look, it's so sweet. It's so absolutely gorgeous. Poppers all the way down and it is footed and she's had this on a few times in the night for bed. It's aged three to six months. Came with a vest, which she hasn't worn at all yet, in pink with tiny white polka dots on. It came with mitts attached because it's three to six months so some babies may still need mitts 
came with a bib, which is just really looks ridiculous on her. I think the bib would be more for Heidi. Because the bib, when you put it around her neck, you can't see any of the bib. It's all whooshed right up. <laughs> but look at it. It's got, it's like, it's the handkerchief shape. Um, like a triangle shape. And it's got like a cut out um, applique of a bunny rabbit on the front. And the embroidery is just so sweet. The little embroidery on the ears. Little embroidery for the tail. Oh, it is so cute. So cute. And it came with a hat. And she has worn the hat. Because the hat and the hat matches the baby grow. So she has worn that because I totally love matching hats <laughs> with baby grows. And I think, of course I haven't got the price because obviously I took it off her, but I think it was something like £12 or £14 for the set. And I didn't think that was bad, no. It wouldn't have been 14 because I wouldn't have paid that. 12 I'm sure it was £12 for the set. So cute. Another dress I've had hanging around for absolutely ages because I never wanted to get rid of it, but I didn't have a baby that it fitted. Is this gorgeous, absolutely stunning white cotton Peter Rabbit Jemima Puddle Duck dress. It is a white dress. It's got Jemima Puddle Duck um, little tag there, which you can't see very well on the screen. And all of this, um, all along the chest area here, is um, hand embroidered. Little flowers, pink, yellow, with um, green leaves. And it's got an embroidered Jemima Puddle Duck on the front. And then it's got a little Peter Pan collar with pink in it. And little arms but I tell you this is even tight around her arms and this is three to six months <laughs> Do you know I might just have to get another baby for this to fit because there is no way I am throwing this away I bought it off of a friend um a reborn mummy friend um gosh years ago must be a good couple of years ago now and it's got an underskirt and the underskirt has got um, broderie on glaze trim and that trim shows just underneath this the skirt of the dress oh it's divine it really is divine it's a damn pain to iron though i'll tell you that <laughs> and it's got a tie at the back so it's like a false belt really but that is lovely. And when I bought this, I also bought a pair of um, pink Jemima Puddle Duck slippers, um, slippers, um, shoes to go with it. But that are you playing with that? Are you? But they don't fit her because <laughs> she has such big old feet. She does. So, like I say, we've had that one for a long time. And then, on another day shopping, actually, I've done an outing with her, which um, I've yet to upload because I've been trying to upload all the stuff about the doll show. Um, so if you haven't seen any of that, check it out. <laughs> but um, yeah, so on the outing with her, I had to get, go in the um, supermarket, go pick up some stuff. And of course, you have to go to the baby section, of course, you know, that's a rule. And I saw this. Um dungaree romper and it is white with cherries all over it i thought they were strawberries first but i think they're cherries with little faces and that on all the cherries have got faces on so it is um so yeah it's like a summer style dungarees and it's got just a little um a little bit of ruffle around the neck and a little bit of ruffle on the shoulder straps and I got it for three pounds and it was only six anyway yeah oh it says there look cherry red yeah three to six months three pounds wow what a bargain now 
The only problem is I have I had no vests to put under this. Boo hoo hoo. So I had to go out and find some vests. So I thought I'm going to be really good and I'm going to go to our local um, second hand store, which you've seen me go in before. And I'm going to show you what I found. So the things I found for her was this. Look at that. That doesn't even look like it's been worn. It is a mother care little thin um, cardigan, pink cardigan with a lovely bit of lace overlay um, to the bodice area, button down. And that is from mother care. And I paid one pound, one pound pound for that so they sell it to me for a pound they give this the um the shop keeps um 50p and the person who brought it into the shop they get 50p and so i think you will have seen me if you haven't i've got a video i'll try and remember to link it somewhere at some point so pop back to this video if i haven't done it by the time you've seen it what did i go in for hey i went in for white long sleeve white shirts well i found this one um or well, short sleeved it didn't matter um, but I found this one from H&M in this same thrift shop and it is four to six months. I'm hoping it will fit her because it's stretchy. It's very stretchy. But it's got this gorgeous lace around the collar. Look at that. And it's just plain white. It's got no marks, no stains, nothing. Obviously, I've put them through the washing machine right now. So I thought that would be great to go underneath it. This was two pounds. And then I picked up just a plain, this plain white one, but because it came with this for two pounds, this dress, this cord mustard winter dress. Look at that. That is just going to, well, if it goes around her waist, I think it will. That is just going to look so neat. In the winter and uh, this set was also mother care set um yeah we don't want that, that language we want english three to six months and that's in really really good condition a really good condition so i'm wondering if um because quite often what you find is that people take in a big bag of stuff that they get from the same shop and um if i'd had a bit more time I would have um, maybe rummaged a bit more. The thing is, and you go in there, so I take stuff in there. So I went in there because I was looking for a white T-shirt. So I went in there and I said to her, um, I said, oh, I've come to have a look for some white T-shirts, three to six months. And so we were rummaging through and I kept seeing other stuff, of course. And so I said to her, look, if I got any money from anything that I've bought in and I had £10.50 back, to myself which meant these things actually didn't outlay me any money at this time because I'd already made use and used the other stuff that I'd had that I'd taken down so and I don't mind because it saves me hassle but there we go so that is all Missy Moo's newest stuff oh you got some new bits now haven't you hey yeah you got some new stuff yeah, we're going to get you out of this because I cannot play. I cannot move my legs. Oh, my God. Oh, so we need another baby that will fit that and the Jemima Puddle Duck dress better. <laughs> oh, Auntie, what am I saying? What am I saying? No. Say no more babies in this house. No more babies in this house. <laughs> and I... Also, I've got her um, a toothbrush coming. She's got to have her own toothbrush and um, sippy cup. I got her a bigger sippy cup than what Heidi and Harry have. They have a smaller one. So anyway, that was um, little Emily's new haul of clothing. Here is little Missy. She's all changed, playing in the nursery in our little um, chair. I love, hello, are you playing with the toys? Can I just show aunties what you've got on? 
Here's that pink romper. Doesn't it look cute? Oh, she's just so lovely. You've got to say, I got teething ring, Auntie. Auntie Anne, I've got a teething ring. And uh, this is a blanket that Auntie Sheena knitted for us. This is her own personal little blankie. All of my girls, well, no, actually, all of my kids have got their own blankie from Auntie Sheena. And a little snuggler. Oh, that's your blankie, isn't it? But I also wanted to show you the other two things that I picked up just for fun. I picked up this um, training toothbrush set. And there we go. Timothy's got one like it. So this is one you give them this one like to, for them to chew in that on. So it gets the feeling of the grooves and everything in their mouth. And then this is the little toothbrush that you can, um, you know, train them with their first little toothbrush. So of course you need that day because they got their toothy pegs. And we got a bigger girl cup, crip and sip. It's quite a heavy cup actually. Might be some of the packaging might be in that, but I don't think so. It feels like quite a heavy, heavy one. It's dentist approved soft flex silicone spout, and it was very reasonable. In fact, I bought both of these off of Amazon, and they were like really, really cheap, cheaper than in the stores. So that was a bonus, and it's got lovely little flowers on. And what I was looking for was one that she could put her hands in either side and hold it up. So I will need to modify that so she can have a drink in it. So there we go. I thought I'd show you those. You want to go back and play with the toys now? Do you say, I don't care. I'm a smiler. It's okay, Mom.